Here's the kicker, Jake Elliott, ready to get this one started. And we are underway from Ford Field. This will be fielded inside the five. And he'll take it up past the 25 to the 26-yard line. So here are the Lions now coming out for their opening drive. And they will be led out by a young man making his first NFL start. They'll start on the ground here on first down. And he's going to take this ahead for right around three yards, but no more than that. Second down. He'll buy some time right. It's a short one here, complete to the tight end. Rookie to rookie on the hookup there, and it's a first down. Here's James. And some space here. And he'll have it past midfield almost to the 40 before being taken down. So from Philadelphia territory now, here's a first and 10 at the 42-yard line. And he's brought down, but not before a really nice stiff arm to create a little space. So not quite a first down just yet as they come up on second and less than a yard. On the move to his left. Looking left sideline, it's complete. And he will reach the eight-yard line before going out. 25 yards that time. A chance for their first points of the season here as it's first and goal. Sanders shaking and baking. And a little bit of space there takes it inside the five to the three. So the ball position now at the three. Here's second and goal. James. That'll be a loss of a yard, and it leads to a third down. He'll try again. And yeah, good work there defensively as they're able to keep him out of the end zone. So taking a risk here early in the new year, they're going to go for it. They'll try and run for it. And he is into the end zone. Touchdown, Detroit. A great effort there. With his... Trying to shake off the interception. He'll look to throw. He'll get this one complete. That's A.J. Brown. And they're able to get this one across the 35. Give him 13 yards on the opening play of the drive and also give him a first down. Here's Hurts to throw. And this one caught along the sideline, but they say already out of bounds. And the throw didn't give him a chance to turn it up field, and that brings up second down. To throw on second and ten. Hurts. That swung out wide to Sanders. And they're going to get this up to midfield. You can almost hear the sigh of relief coming from their sideline and from their point on the field because this has been a tough start for them thus far. A much needed first down there. They needed something good to happen. Hurts fumbles it. Points one, two, and three in their defensive game plan was to get to the quarterback and knock the ball free. They did it there. Luckily, offense hangs on to it. Yeah, that's got to serve as a wake-up call, though, because they can't afford to let the ball go over to the defense and miss opportunities. And I'm not saying it happened here, but you know what a good rule of thumb is when a play like that occurs? You know who usually recovers it? The guy who missed his block and let his quarterback get hit. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. And that is incomplete. Every offense tells you they want to come out and start fast. That's not unusual at all. But this group, they've yet to get much rolling through their first two drives. It looks like they have to give up the football again after this one. And he'll go ahead and field this at the five. That'll be put in the books as a 53-yard punt. And the Lions are going to take over with a long field ahead and a first and ten. They'll start this drive out on the ground. And he's got some space here. And he'll get this one way on just shy of the 45-yard line. Took just one play to move all the way to the 44 as they try again on first down. A throw there, but that's going to wind up incomplete. I like the calmness of how he played the ball here. No panic in his eyes as that throw arrived. Tracked it from the moment it left the quarterback's hand, and that's just where he needed to be to knock it away. And they'll hold him to three there as he takes this up to the 47. On 
third down. He'll drop to throw. He's going to drop this down to Sanders. And the tackle going to be made at the 38. Now this offense in midseason form here in the opener. It's first and 10. Now a shotgun snap as they'll look to throw. Eagle pressure too much this time. Down he goes. Work to be done here on second and 16 after the sack. He'll drop to throw. He'll rifle this one deep right side. And he knocks the ball away and it falls incomplete. I know conventional wisdom says, hey, don't get it all back in one play. But sometimes you go ahead and try to. They tried to get it all back on that one. Weren't able to do so. Got a man, it's caught inside the 10. Touchdown, Detroit. They'll start on the ground here on first down. And able to get it across the 20 before they get to it. Now a play fake here on first down. And that nearly a turnover, but it's incomplete. Oh, fortunate to retain possession there, and it's second down. On the ground, it's James. And a stiff arm made it a pretty little run, not a huge gain, but a nice chunk of yardage. Off the play fake, he'll look to throw. And that's going to be incomplete. The contact there enough to jar that ball free, and it brings up fourth down. On fourth down, they'll try and run for it. And some room to run now. Takes this one in for a Lions turn. They'll look to throw here on first down. Looking middle, and that's complete. And he'll be brought down at about the 23-yard line. Back-to-back -back good plays have him on the move on first down. Throwing there, but this pass is going to wind up incomplete. He didn't just deny a big throw there. He broke that one up in the red zone. An excellent play, one that may help save points on the board when this drive is over. He's got a man that's caught left sideline. They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw. Looking end zone, but it's incomplete. The way he's been slinging in the first half, you expect everything he throws to go for a touchdown, but I guess he's got to wait to try to pick up that third, isn't he? Yeah, I thought he had him for his... And that is caught! Touchdown, Detroit! They start on the ground here at Sanders. And this will be a gain of five as he gets it to the 30. After the pickup of five, here's second and five. Here's a play fake as they set up to throw. He's going to rifle one deep left side. And that's going to be incomplete. Good effort there trying to take a shot, but it's third down. The line's on third down. They've hit two for four thus far. This will be third and five. And this pass broken up. But the contact well timed there. And now fourth down. They're indeed going for it as they look to throw. And this time he's got the hookup. It's complete. And he's going to have the Lions first down as they manage to convert. And that'll keep the drive alive. And now here's a deep shot that's complete. A big play there for Detroit. 53 yards. They'll look to throw again. Now he's got it. That's good for a gain of six, second and goal. Again, he'll drop the throw. And he's got his man. It's caught for a land touchdown. They'll start this drive out on the ground. And he'll take this one up to about the 13. Two minutes remaining in this first half of football. 
A reminder that when halftime rolls around, Jonathan Coachman will have all the highlights and analysis of this first half of play from our studios in Orlando. Now, meanwhile, here's a second down throw that's knocked away and incomplete. An incomplete pass on that last play, and that means they'll need to come up with something here on third down. Taken down, but they've got this one up to the 35-yard line. And quickly, they get to the line. Back to throw now on first down. Quick hitter here, it's complete. They'll wind up getting seven on the play, and it'll be second down. Back to throw. And he can't find a receiver, and he's brought down. They'll need five on this play to move the sticks. Third down throw, but it misses the target incomplete. That might be the third down stop that they needed because they've had a lot of trouble slowing down this offense in the first half. This might be their opportunity to get off the field. And he comes back with one complete. So this drive going to continue following the conversion on fourth. Here's first and ten. He's going to rifle one deep left side. And it's incomplete. Took a shot, couldn't connect. Early on, the running game's been working well, and the offensive line has been pleased by that. The thought process there, catch those safeties creeping up, trying to help against the running game. They tried to hit them over the top. Unsuccessful. The Lions will use the first of their timeouts as they stop it with 19 seconds to go in half number one. zone on first down, but it winds up incomplete. Everyone's eyes go to him when he nears the end zone, and that includes the coverage. He took away the easy throwing lanes and forced a high throw. And that is caught. Touchdown Detroit. A great effort there with his first career NFL touchdown. And the Lions are looking good here in the season opener as they're able to extend their lead. So a good start to the campaign so far for them here in week one. Yeah, all the things that you dreamed about in April and May and that you worked on in July and August, getting ready for this game, it's all coming together so far. Now after the touchdown, here's Elliott on to kick it away. Fields it right around the goal line. And able to get this across the 20, but not much further as he's dropped at the 23-yard line. We'll remind you that coming up tonight, the first Sunday nighter of the new season. And how about this for a matchup? The Buccaneers and the Cowboys from Dallas, 820 Eastern. Then tomorrow, Monday night, just one game here in week one this year. And it'll pit the Broncos and Seahawks as Russell Wilson makes his Bronco debut. And of course, where is it? Seattle. Coincidence? We'll let you decide. It's incomplete. Took a shot, couldn't connect. They come up now third and five following the incomplete pass. And a throw there going to be incomplete. Uh, he's smart enough to avoid the taunting rule, but I'm guaranteeing he quietly has told them, you might want to stop coming after me downfield because I just broke up another pass and took away a big shot that you were trying to succeed with. This time he's got the hookup. It's complete. And he's going to have the Lions first down as they manage to convert. And that'll keep the drive alive. He's going to rifle one deep left side. He's got a man complete. A big play there for Detroit. 58 yards. Part, I'm not sure how this drive's going to end, but how about the way they flip field position there? A nice attacking play. They picked up a heck. And he'll get into the end zone. Touchdown, Detroit. They'll start on the ground here on first down. And he'll manage to pick up about four at second down. The run got four. Now they deal with a second and six. And down he goes, but he takes it up to the 40. Altogether, a pretty shaky start to the year for this defense as they defend another first and 10. And he takes this up right near the 45-yard line. And now it looks like they're going to be in the hurry up. Second and five. 
And a quick throw here, that's complete. And he has another first down as they get the ball down to the Eagles' 44-yard line. They run it with James. And he'll run straight into a wall of tacklers at the line of scrimmage. It's second down. On second down, it's James. And for one of the few times here today, this run's not going to go anywhere. On play action, they'll throw. And he can't find anywhere to go with it. And he goes down. Give the sack to Fletcher Cox. We've watched this a long time, and I still don't believe we get it. Third and long, why are you calling play action? Yeah, because they're not going to bite defensively, right? No, not at all. I did have the coach explain to me years ago that for some teams, that's how they have to deal with pass protection and the line blocking. But to me, it seems so. Yeah, well, they're silly and they to play. It's a second down run with Sanders. He spins free. Oh, he's got a little daylight. And he will finally be shoved out of bounds down at the 30-yard line. 52 yards rushing for him now, and he's only carried the ball four times. And that one heck of a run right there. Once he got loose, you could tell that he was going to run a long way. That was pretty impressive. Powering forward. And they're going to get this down inside the 15. And they're going to speed things up here. Inside the red zone here, they'll look to throw. To the goal line, but it's incomplete. That was a touchdown if he could have hung on. Instead, it was a well-timed collision to jar that one free. Now a second down throw for the end zone, but it's incomplete. Nice back-to-back -back plays defensively. They're stacking momentum now. One incompletion, two incompletion. They're going for more. Back to throw again. Toward the back corner of the end zone, but he could. Plenty of shouts from this crowd as they watch the replay. They want a challenge, and they're going to get one. The previous play is under review. And we'll get a moment here as they look this one over. Yeah, remember now, the call on the field is what they'll stick with unless they have clear video evidence to the contrary. And I give these officials a lot of credit. After review of the play, ruling on the field. So the decision to challenge does not pan out, and that's also going to cost them a timeout. And they fake it. They pitch to the tight end. Ready, break. Right back to him on first down. And he can only manage to get a couple. Second and eight coming up. On second down now. It's James. And he'll get this up to about the 40. Looking to speed things up here, going with some tempo. On third down, James. And he'll be taken down, but he does have first down yardage. A pair of first downs gives him a first and 10 up at the 44. He'll lose a yard there, and it's second and 11. Now they'll switch it up here and look to throw. And he finds a man with a crossing round. And he has another first down as he'll get the ball down to the Eagles' 34-yard line. They'll roll him out right. He's going to go out of bounds, but he takes this one down just shy of the 20. A nifty bit of scrambling there. 12 yards, first down. They run the counter. It's James. Two yards on the pickup there. It'll be second and eight. They'll keep it on the ground. It's James. Nine yards to pick up there, and it's a first down. And they're going to hurry back to the line now. On first down. James had a missed tackle there as he pushes forward for a gain of four. On second down, it's James. And he will fight his way in. Here we go, here we go. It'll be Sanders to begin the drive. They find some open field here. And a pretty good burst there as he'll get this across midfield and down to the 46. Now on first down, he'll drop to throw it. Firing quickly here, and that's complete. 
And he'll be taken down here just shy of the 30. Back to back good plays have him on the move on first down. He's got his man. It's caught from. They'll start this drive out on the ground. And a short pickup to about the 25. And the last run got three. Now here's second and seven. The play action fake. They'll look to throw. He'll rifle this one deep right side. And that will be incomplete. Trying to dial up the long way, way out there, but it'll be third down. Out of the gun now on third down. He's going to try and go deep again. And that's caught inside the 35. And he'll be taken down here just shy of the 30. So the big play changes the complexion of things. Here's first and 10 just outside the 30. He's going to go up top again. And this will be caught. And the carnage can... 